Hello, YouTube. We're back for another video today. I'm Jake from Peyton B and their friend, and tonight we're playing this dreadful game called Identity V. I um I know nothing about it. <laughs> I totally didn't play this for a video yesterday, and I'm not playing it today. Um, right. Um. Okay, um, I don't have a club for Call of the Abyss. So, um, it's post recruitment and yeah. All right. So let's see here. Um, character day for Helena. Okay. Yeah, I guess. Good grief, everyone in the chat is just saying happy birthday, Helena. Oh my gosh. Okay, well, I just did two. All right, so let's do our daily check-in bull crap. Why are none of these people getting any activity points for the group? I'm not sure. And why is the chairman here um, clearly a bit inactive? <laughs> like, really? Okay, let's get my daily share reward, and then let's see. Oh my gosh, why, do, why am I still being sent so much intimacy? Like, please. <laughs> Why is everyone trying to get so intimate with me? Okay, weekend quest, okay. Guys, I'm just drawing this out because I don't think rank starts until... Let's see here. Wrong button. They don't start until three minutes, so I have to keep you guys entertained for... um. Three minutes <laughs> until then. So okay, let's see. What do what do we have in the shop here? Um, shit that I don't want. Okay, shit that I can't afford. I so you know, guys, I bought like I literally bought a, a Google Play gift card. You know, as one does whenever you're trying to buy Echoes. Okay, I bought it. And that shit did not work. Like, I literally entered the gift card and shit. And it was like, please give us more details. You have to email us details. Like, bro, I'm not giving Google my information. And then they said that it'll take two months, like... Like, bro, the, the crossover ends in, like, 12 days. Like, the fuck do you want from me? Like, seriously. Oh, my gosh. I literally just want to get this damn skin. Like, like literally. You know how there's people in the chat? And, like, the English one chat who will um say that, like, if you friend them, they'll give you stuff from your wish list. And then, you know, you friend them and stuff, and they're like, um, you know, they're, they're wanting to, like, trade with you, if you know what I mean by that. <laughs> like, <laughs> bro, bro, I literally had to consider doing that. Like, I'm sorry, that's, that's probably not very appropriate to say. Especially coming from me, who's 17, but I literally considered that because I'm so f desperate for the skin here. And, like, whenever I told my, um, um, non-specified parental figure, 
about like the gift card and about how that it didn't work. Like, oh my goodness. Like, it, it was not my damn fault, but yeah, I got blamed. And like, like, oh my gosh, like, like literally either like, like, bro, I've tried to sucker like multiple of my friends into like, you know, um, gifting me this skin and it's not really working out for me. Um, which, um, guys don't gift it to me because if you do, then I will genuinely feel bad after just saying all this. Okay, let's see if rank is open. Hallelujah, it is. Time to rank. <laughs> but, um, yeah, guys, moral of the story. Um, this game sucks. And, um, I'm just waiting around until they figure out that, like, cure for autism or whatever them Republicans say. And keep on yapping about, like, cause, damn, I need that, like, not for any particular reason, but I mean, look at this, it's literally Hello Kitty, like, seriously, like, it's literally Hello Kitty, you guys don't know how much I love Hello Kitty, and, like, Identity V, I like that too. You know, like they combined it, it and then it this happened. And I didn't want it, I need it, but then, like, then Google, you know, the damn, you know, multi trillion dollar corporation. You know, I go to Walmart that I buy a gift card for like $25 and, um, I buy it, and then I enter, thinking that it'll work, and then it didn't, so now my money's wasted, and now I'm screwed because I can't get the the Joseph Cinnamon Roll skin. I can't believe it. I can't get the skin, even though it, it's Sanrio. Like, oh my gosh, guys. Like, literally. Okay, now we're finally in a match here. Let's see what shenanigans we'll get up to. First thing that I gotta go do is find a cipher. Absolutely the hardest part. Well, actually, it's only hard whenever other people... Or running into your cipher that you want to go to cipher. <laughs> Actually, why is it even called decoding, though? Because if it's a cipher, then shouldn't you decipher it? Like, okay, sorry for my observation here but now that i just think about that now i am um mildly distressed here because literally why but then again though why is it called kiting if like you're just running around like trying to avoid getting hit by the hunter like that, I don't really understand. Okay, well, um, Doctor is getting her behind kicked. And do not run over here. Please go away. Heal yourself. Oh my gosh, is that literally undead? Please get away from me immediately. Yep. You have got to be kid. I'm trying to decode over here. Get away from me. Get shoe. Oh my goodness. Okay, well, I am, um, I am getting my ass handed to me here. Um, 
Okay, well, apparently someone over there is decoding. So I'm gonna go get them to, like, heal me. Hey, you! Let's see, who is it? Um, a toy merchant. Please, please heal me. Okay, I'm being healed. So now, let me think here. Maybe Toy Merchant will, like, follow me and, like, go heal this doctor because, like, oh, well, nope, she is going in the other direction. Okay, well, somehow doctor just got up. I'm not really going to question how, but, um, okay. I don't really play many matches against undead. Um, then again, I mean, there is um, better hunters out there. Well, Gardner just got hit. But that sounds like that it's not a me issue because currently I'm trying to decode. Okay. Focus on the code. Yes, I'm focusing. I'm hyper focusing. You could even say hyper fixating. Okay, let's see here. Okay, got that. Cipher done. Alright, now we only got one more. I'm gonna go... Okay, go there. I'm guessing that somebody already primed the cipher. Oh, well, I didn't need to bother checking into that because... Now I need to go open that, the exit gate. Guess I better do that. I think there is people over at the other exit gate. Yeah, there is. I'm... Bam it, Gardener! Quit spamming focus on decoding! I am decoding! What the hell do you want from me, bitch? Jeez. Okay, well now the... The gate open. Get out of here. Nuh uh, you get out of here. <laughs> okay. Well, let's like give everyone a courtesy thumbs up. Well, I'd say for the first ranked match of. Um, I mean, the first ranked match I've ever had. I'd say for once, people was actually able to control themselves. Except for that gardener who was getting a little bit too pushy about the decoding. Other than that, I'd say everyone... ...restrained themselves... ...sufficiently. No toxic outbursts. Nobody here in post-match chat. Good. Okay, actually, I'm gonna just... Um... There we go. Okay. Let's see. Let's see what all the frenzies are doing here with their logic path ranking. Okay, this bitch is already at a hundred. Um, this guy is at zero. Um, you need to play the game. Oh my gosh, please. Okay, let's see, what do I have here? Oh wait, I haven't picked out a guaranteed first straw item. I don't know, let's see here. What what do I really want, bro? What do I really need? Um 
Oh, I definitely don't want that. Um, let's see. Uh, <laughs> uh, 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 oh, I don't want that. Hell no. Nah. Uh, hmm. Okay, I'm preparing for match finally. <laughs> okay, we got a psychologist here with the with that one S tier. Okay. Um But yet we have no patient. <laughs> Come on, cheerleader, ready up. We're all waiting on you. Jeebers. I just noticed how stupid cheerleader's name is. Like, really? You just, like, banged your keyboard on, like, the numbers? Like, what? I'm sorry, like, man. You know, I've had... Actually, no, my username is not stupid. And I've never, ever had a stupid username before on Identity V. Because this is my only account ever. I've never, ever, ever, ever played on any other accounts. Like, never. And, um, I have never had to change a name on any accounts either. Not at all. Okay. Let's. Okay, we got somebody decoding in there, so I will connect my cipher to theirs. Okay. Everything is going smooth. Ugh. Okay, um, let's see here. So far, oops, um, lol. Jeez, I hope the hunter doesn't have teleport. Okay, well, I guess not. All right, time to my cipher up with another one. It's quite a far way. Okay, what was that over there? Oh, well, I'm, um, I'm just gonna run this way. Okay, is that, is that another undead? Jeez, my luck is bad today with the undeads. Animation. Jeez, that undead was dumb. Well, I guess I better go hook the ciphers up again. Uh, bitch, get off my cipher. Okay, well, I guess I'm just gonna have to help her out. Oh, well, I guess she got the gist and got away. Okay. Now, let's see what's cooking over here. Um, well, see here, I guess I better go decode there. There's the basement. Okay, hi, cheerleader. I'll hook that cipher up with that one. And just because... Yeah, now I'm going to make cheerleader decode that. 
going to waltz on over here. I totally know what I'm doing. All right. There we go. Okay. Now let me see what cipher I should go to next. All right, and go. Uh, I guess I'll go help. Um, hmm. Actually, no, I'm closer to this one. So I'll go help cheerleader out. Yeah, I really helped with that one, guys. Okay, well... Okay, for once we have somebody who's actually smart enough to know that Luca should be the one decoding the exit gate. Um, hallelujah. Oh, and I'm even being encouraged. Aw. Okay, well, that's not good. Um, yeah, go chase cheerleader. Okay. Well, I'm gonna just... Sorry, but... Um... Yeah, that's not very good. Okay, can I get the hell out of here before the hunter gets me? Ha <laughs> ha, el bozo. All right, so then for once, people in rank are actually being civil and actually playing properly. Okay, well, do see what are we on here? Um, yeah, okay, this will be the last ranked match. I'd say I'm pretty impressed that things are actually going smoothly for once. I mean, I totally don't know how rank works at all. I've uh, never ranked before, ever. Never done any rank grinding, ever. Mm -hmm. Okay, now I get to do more around you know guys I honestly can't tell you what my highest rank has been before because I don't really know um, let me think here I mean I, man let me think here um so I think after the B it's a dog. So, I think the highest rank that I have been has been the dog because uh, I typically don't play rank that much. I mean, I've never played rank before, but um, you see, most of the time, though, I actually don't play rank because. Uh, like, it's only open at certain times of the day. And I say day because at, like, 12, I think it's 12 or 11 through 5 a.m., it's not open. And currently, I'm doing 5 a.m. rank. Okay, we've got... Well, the Emil and the Ada are not matching skins, but it is, in fact, Ada and Emil. Well, okay. Sticker. Okay. Why is everyone saying hi? I'm not very sure. Um, okay. So if I win this match, then I... Um, let me think here. 
than I should have. Three wins today. This cipher machine cannot be decoded. Damn. How dare that cipher machine? That is my job to decode it, and it's literally stopping me from doing so? How dare you? Okay, well, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna hook this cipher up with this one over there. Now, gardener, don't touch the transmission speed. Or whatever it's called. Please. Because I'm going to go over here and the code over there. Yeah. Okay. Gardener, what did I tell you? Well, since she's giving me um decode thing, I'm not going to send any her way because she touched the transmission whenever I told her not to. So she will be stuck on her own. <laughs> it's Okay, wait, um, patient was over there saying, decoding progress, don't know where, let me see, okay, over there, so, let's just go, just run over there, Hey, speeder, it, it hit me, ow, Hey, it's gonna get me. Ew. Well, um... Focus on the coding. Well, that's... Oh. Don't want a bug. Patient hey, over there. Okay, um... Well... I... Damn, how are we already at one cipher remaining? Am I reading that right? <laughs> Actually, this hunter might just- Oh, jeez. Actually, this hunter might just be really incompetent, and that's probably why everyone's able to actually decode for once. Oh. Oh, right after shocking the hunter, I got hit. Well, I, um... Kind of deserved that. I am. I'm not getting saved because this hunter has detention. So you know what? I'm. Um, I think I'm just gonna have to take the L. Okay. What is the hunter doing? Oh no! The hunter's going over there. Well. Um, okay. Let's see. Yeah, the hunter's going after. Oh, well, no, they already had it open. Okay, well. Oh, someone's actually coming to save me? Okay, probably because they seen that the hunter is nowhere to be found. Oh, damn! <laughs> the hunter surrendered. Holy shit. <laughs> <laughs> I think they was mad because I got saved. Oh damn! <laughs> well, <laughs> that <laughs> that was pretty good. Okay, let's get all the battle rewards. Okay, why did I just open up the snipping tool? No. Okay, let's see here. Get these. I think yesterday's video was where I was doing the law, your birthday event. So I guess today I did the Helena birthday event. 
Okay, now let's open up this here. Wow, I got five costume remnants. I don't even know what those are for, honestly. Um, okay, and I got a profile picture. It's just Hello Kitty. Man, I want one of these, like... The event ends in, like, 12 days, so I'm, like, I'm a little bit doubtful that I'm gonna be able to, like, get them. Because you can only get three of these in a day. So, yeah, I don't... Well, hold up, let me think here. So if you can get three in a day... Three divided by 21, that's, um... That's seven. So in actuality, it'd only take you a week to get all of the thingies if you get if you got all of these every day. But um let's see, I'm like half way through. So I'd only need to do it for three and a half days. But I, um, um, you see, I, um, I'm going to make up an excuse for myself for why I don't have to play Identity that much. Because, guys, I, um, I don't play Identity V, um, um, don't question what I'm doing right now, but um, I'm not playing Identity V. I could never, in fact, play Identity V. Absolutely not. Cannot stand it. Oh, well, I got best deduction today. I've been such a good doggy. Oof. Okay, let me see here. Does this... Damn, this closet don't do anything. I wanna go in there, I wanna like hide in the closet. Damn, this bed doesn't do anything either, except for... Advertising Call of the Abyss. Like... Bro, I don't wanna like be in the Call of the Abyss, I don't care. I wanna like get in that bed... So that, like, I can sleep in it. Like, damn, dude, I just want to go to bed. Like, like, you know, just go to bed. And, um, oh my goodness, like, okay, like, go to bed. And, then, like, not get out of bed. Like, not in a concerning way, guys. Just, like, man, I just want to, like, sleep. Like, bro, I'm... I'm fucking tired constantly. You no, know, I sleep like an average of at least 11 hours every day. Um, the most that I've slept in a day has been 15 hours. Um, but like, man, I need like 24 hours of sleep per day to function. Because, man, I'm not functioning right now. I'm literally sitting over here at, like, 5 in the morning. It's almost 6 in the morning. No sleep. And I'm over here recording a damn Identity V YouTube video. No, nobody watches my videos. Like, literally, my, um... Um, unspecified parental figure. I, um, yeah, currently she's not getting any shout outs from me on my channel because she quit making Mahjong videos. And you see, she doesn't think that I watched them, but I actually did. So I'm not very enthused, but, um, yeah, you see. Like, um, what was I saying? I already forgot. 
Oh yeah. Um like yeah, she doesn't even watch my videos. Like literally I I literally told her like you know that I made an identity V video and she asked how long it was and I said like forty minutes and she said she's not gonna sit and watch that. She's not gonna sit and watch me play identity V for like forty minutes and I was like, Oh wow, thanks. Like and then she was like, oh, well, I'm not going to, like, sit there and watch someone play a game. Like, my mother in Christ, you make gameplay videos. Like, what do you just, like, you know, what do you think of your viewers? Which, um, by the way, guys, and by guys, I specifically just mean Coca Cola. Hi, B F F F F F F F F F L. Um, I um, you see, she told me like insider secret, bro. Like totally, but um, yeah, she told me she does not care about her viewers, and that. To, she would and if she could if she wouldn't if she could she would quit YouTube and if you guys want to know why I'm telling you this it is because I personally am not very enthused she started YouTube because she thought it'd be cool now she's just quitting even though she has fit, like 50 something subscribers and she's just gonna leave them in the dark the unbelievable then you coca-cola i know you in particular are dedicated to her content because she posts this garbage daily and you sit through that garbage and you watch it so yeah i don't know what you would do without her I mean, you'd probably just be stuck re-watching my videos. Which would get very tiresome eventually. Because my videos are not good. The Chur videos are very good. Even though all she does is play the daily challenges of Microsoft Solitaire. And used to Mahjong. But now she doesn't anymore because she doesn't care about you guys. But I care about you guys. I want to have a parasocial relationship with you guys. And the only reason why I want to have a parasocial relationship with you guys is because I don't have any other relationships. Except for the ones in my head. Um. Jeez, this guy's hot. I mean, um. Yeah, guys, have a parasocial relationship with me. Because, oh my gosh, I want this kid so bad. I mean, um, have a parasocial relationship with me because I love you and you love me and all of my viewers, <laughs> they love you too. This is not a cult. I mean, or what do the cool kids call it nowadays? A fault? Uh, fox. Fake. I mean, fake. Cult. Fault. Yeah, that's what the cool kids are calling it nowadays. Um, guys, we're not a cult. We are a... Well, not a fault either. Actually, no, I don't want to be associated with them people. Nuh-uh. Um, okay, she's kind of hot. Actually, no, that's not what we're here for, guys. We're here because you guys like it that I am mentally ill. You guys are very attracted to that. And I post my mental breakdowns on YouTube because I love you. 
because I know that you do not exist. That is right. You do not exist because nobody watches my videos. So therefore, that means that you are not watching my video currently because I have no viewers. And that means that you are not a viewer. You just don't exist. I'm not schizophrenic, though. I, I definitely am not. <laughs> okay, if you think that I am, then you are incorrect. Because I am not schizophrenic. How dare you? Okay, because... I mean, yeah, the only people who do seriously sit and watch my videos are my friends in my head. But, you see, um, they, they are my, um, my <laughs> they are the only people who care about me. Because in reality, nobody cares about me. And reality sucks. But in reality, I have people in my head. I mean, no, I don't. Nuh-uh. -uh. I just lied to you guys. I don't have people in my head. I am schizophrenic. And I don't have people in my head. I do not have headmates. I have no clue what a dissociative identity disorder is. Because I don't have that, in fact. I mean, how could I? Because um, people who have that, they do not. Yeah, that's right. Um, people who have that, they do not. Because other people don't exist. So therefore, if nobody exists, nobody can have associative identity disorder because I don't, you don't, nobody does, nobody here does, stop asking me about it because no matter how many times you ask, you will not know because I will not have any more abusive ex-boyfriends because those suck and um I especially don't like the one who um thinks that he's a damn Mandela catalog character yeah I don't like you but you see, I do like you because guess what? You don't exist. So therefore, that means that I can't not like you because you don't exist. So therefore, since you do not exist, I don't have to worry my pretty little head about you ever coming back into my life. Or, well, I don't think you would anyway. Probably because if you knew about what I say about you, then, um, you probably would not be too pleased. But I have good reasoning for saying the sayings that I do. It's because I am not pleased with you. Because your behavior was, um, very abhorrent to me and all of my friends. It was very abhorrent, in fact, so abhorrent, in fact, that I had to Say something about it to other people. In which now they know. And, um, they probably did not change their opinion about you. Because, um, your reputation is not the highest, in fact. You see? But you see, the reason that I, in fact, do not like you is because you are A, U, B, I, S, T. E S. 
and that is bad. And um, also like um, you know, I didn't really like the part whenever you um subliminally convinced me. I really don't like being subliminally convinced. And whenever you did that, it did not make me feel very joyous. In fact, whenever you did do that, it made me feel quite awful, in fact. So, don't do that. Because if you try to do it again, I will, um, let me think here, what will I do? I will have to interrupt your subliminally convincing. That's right, whenever you try to send messages into my mind, I will block them out. <laughs> and whenever you try to subconsciously persuade me, I will flat out ignore it, <laughs> because I was very sick and tired of having to seriously roleplay as Edgar from the game Identity V, because um, I was not a big fan of that, <laughs> in fact, because, you see, um, actually, I don't really remember that, but I remember I did not really like that, because, you see, I don't really like being delusional. I mean, no, 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 I love it, but um, I don't love you, so I don't love whenever you make me delusional. That does not make me very pleased. Because um, whenever you took advantage of my um, schizophrenia, I um, that did not make me feel very happy. It made me feel quite sad. And um, that was also kind of bad. Don't do that to people. And to all of my viewers who do not exist, um, don't do that to the people in your lives, because it's not good. Don't subliminally convince people, because that is bad. Don't do that. And, um, also, by the way, um, um, what will I call you? How will I address you? Abusive ex-boyfriend. Um, let me think here. Uh, well, I don't remember your name. Actually, I don't think you had a name. Hmm. Which no fictional character's names does not count as a name. Hmm. I'll call you, um... Hmm. 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 I'll call you, um, um, well, let me think here. I could give you a name based on your personality, if you had one, or I could give you a name based off your looks, if you had some. Actually, I don't think I can give you a name, because here's a fun fact. You do not exist. So therefore, since you do not exist, 
I actually don't have to give you a name. So, um, Mr. Or Missy. Yeah, you can be Missy. There you go. That'll be your name. Your name can be Missy. Okay, so Missy, if you are listening to this right now, as you are, because you're probably stalking me and planning on killing me and harvesting my organs and other questionable deeds upon my corpse. Um, don't do that to me. I probably don't taste very good. But, um, if you are listening to this, just know I am not fond of you. In fact, every time I think of you, it makes me want to puke. And when I want to puke, I do not feel very happy because whenever I am nauseous, I do not feel very well. And you see, whenever I do not feel very well, I feel bad. Because when I feel bad, I feel sad. And that's what you make me feel. You make me feel very sad. Because half the time I cannot remember anything about you. But probably because you are mind controlling me and purposefully making it so that I cannot remember stuff. That sure doesn't sound like any familiar tactics to me, though. Not at all. Because making people purposefully dissociate does not sound like anything that a bad person would do, right? Doesn't sound like anything that somebody with malicious intent would do, right? I mean, intentionally taking advantage of somebody's already existing memory problems isn't that much of a problem, right? <laughs> I mean, if it's already there, then it's free game, right? <laughs> But that's all I was treated as, was free game. Because after all, don't you think we knew each other for quite a while? I mean, I met you a while ago. A year ago. Two years ago. Maybe it's two years ago. I met you then, and I fell in love, but yet you didn't love me, because you was after my girlfriend at the time. Because my girlfriend at the time, who is now my ex-girlfriend, but I'm still trying to chase after her, I mean, you, you chased after her because you wanted her, because she was weak. And that was not very nice for you to do, because you made her feel very sad. And you made her feel very much a lot of pain. And I do not like that, because whenever she is in pain, I am in pain. So don't do that. <laughs> but also, that was not very nice of you, because what you did to subliminally convince her, that was not very nice. And um, whenever you subliminally convinced me, that was not very nice. And um, I think you're, um, subliminally convincing people don't do that. Don't subliminally convince people. Quit doing that. <laughs> And, um, also, stay away from my now ex-girlfriend. Don't go near her. Also, don't go near me, though. I, none of us like you. Um, I don't like you. She don't like you. 
None of my friends like you. None of her friends like you. We don't like you. So stay away from me. Because I was not a big fan also of whenever you did that stuff to my girlfriend who I'm allowed to name drop. Her name is Ray, guys. Please, everyone, go. Um, um, go. Um, what's the word? Um, go give her moral support. Yes. But, um, I was not a very big fan, um, of what you did to her. Because, you know, Missy, I think that you, um, have a issue. Yes, because whenever you made her detransition, just because... Your, um, G-A-Y, even though you two already was together, and you willingly got together with a girl, um, apparently you was not very fond of having a girlfriend, even though I've got bad news for you. Um, at the time you was dating her, you ha you was dating somebody else who was a, um, closeted trans girl. And also, um, my ex is your ex. And she's a girl. So why do you like her? Hmm? Exactly. But, uh, you see, I was not a very big fan of whenever you made Ray these transition. Because that made her feel very hurt. Uh, because you threatened to break up with her. Which was not very nice. Uh, that was very mean, in fact. And, uh, also, you could not have done that anyway. Because, you know, whenever we told you the rules of the relationship, we specifically told you that we would all be together. Together. So therefore, you can't just kick Ray out without saying anything, because first off, um, you don't have that authority, because you had only been in that relationship for like two months. <laughs> and second off, you can't do that, because Ray is Ray, and I love her, and I don't love you, so you can't do that. And also, I'm not a fan of what you did to Peyton B either. That was not very nice. Um, why would you get with us if you didn't want to ever be with Peyton B? You know, like, why would you date someone? And never talk to them. Why would you do that? Actually, why did you do anything you did? Well, I'm, I'll never have an answer from you, Missy. Since you don't exist. But, actually, I don't want to know why you did anything you did. None of us want to hear your reasoning. Because we know you are a liar. And because you are a liar, that means you tell lies. And we do not like those lies. Because whenever we are lied to, it does not make us feel very good. In fact, whenever you lied to us, it made us very sad. Because we knew you was lying to us, but yet we couldn't do anything. Well, we couldn't really do much of anything about your behavior because 
um, we had no power within the relationship. <laughs> I was your um, dog. Woof. And since I was your dog, that means I had to take all of your commands. But, um, I'm not your dog anymore because first off, you don't exist. But also, I broke up with you. And I broke up with you for good reason. Because, um, you are not good. Because, um, you make people feel pain. Like, a lot of it. And that is not good. That is bad. Um, you are bad, too. Um, yeah. Don't be bad. Stop it. <laughs> Missy, you need to get your act straight. <laughs> Well, actually, I can't say that, because you do not exist, and what you do now is none of my problem, because you are gone, and since you are gone, I don't care what you do now. That's right, I don't care. So, um, shoo. Shoo, shoo. And yeah, guys, that'll be it for our video. Give us a like if you like the cool Identity V content. Give us a subscribe if you want more Identity V content. Which, don't worry, guys, I'll still do unboxing videos once I actually get stuff to unbox but yeah and give a comment down below if you like to watch videos and if you exist to watch videos which i like all of you viewers as my viewers i'm sorry to say this but I'll never get to know you guys personally, but for some reason, you know me personally. So, yeah, and, um, videos. Bye.